the worst DJs in the world. Ladies and gentlemen, all the way from New Zealand, we have Vinyl Burns. Hello, hi. Hello, Macedonia. Skopje, Vinyl Burns here. Hello, living yeah. the dream. You're a manager and a DJ. I, that's correct. I do a little bit of everything. And you make a barbecue also? Well, I, I have to be honest. Uh, somebody else made this barbecue. I just walked up to it and started talking to you. So how do you like uh, Macedonia so far? It's, uh, it's too hot. And it's too hot. Like, uh, you can promote somebody, bring uh, from your stars that you manage. You manage a lot of stars who is in your list. Oh, I'm working with a gentleman, Tape Face, boy with tape on his face. He's doing very well in America right now, uh, and I manage him. He doesn't like me to tell people that, but I do manage him. And uh, he's, uh, yeah, check him out, Tape Face, boy, boy with tape on his face. Or well, you can find me at vinylburns.com. Yeah, and uh, tell me more about your DJ uh, affinities. Well, you know, skills. I just love music, and I love music, and I love people. And I know music, and I know some people, but they don't like me to say that I know them, because they're shy. Uh, so I play music for the people that I like, and then I play music that I don't like for people that I don't like. Okay, so you're once pronounced the worst DJ in the world? No, that's a way. Well, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Uh -huh. How can you become the worst DJ? It takes a lot of work. You have to fight through a lot of people saying, no, don't play. But if you keep playing when people are saying, don't play, eventually you'll succeed. And you know what I say about success? Success is losing on your own terms. What are you doing here in Skopje, Mr. Burns? I'm just sitting around and they're trying to make me work, but I don't like that. I'm going to try and have a barbecue and have a nice time. But uh, when they finally get around to catching me, I'm going to be doing some of the best uh, high-altitude rock and roll guitar playing uh, down in uh, Ale Alexandra, what's the name of the square? Macedonia. Macedonia Square. Is that the name of the square? Yeah. Yeah, there. We are not very in inventive here. Yeah. That's all right. Macedonia Everybody. Street, Macedonia Square. Keep it straight. Keep it straight shooting. People know what it's called and they know where it is. What do you like the most in Macedonia? Macedonia, I gotta say, the uh, I like the old markets. I'm a little bit of a hipster. I like a retro vibe, a, uh, a classic atmosphere. I like the old markets, uh, the the uh, the espresso, and I uh, I'm getting a suit made because uh, Macedonian tailoring is I'm led to believe fantastic. Yeah, uh, but generally the people, you can't go past the people. Look at these people. Look at this guy. Beautiful. Ah. Having, a, having a cigarette there. He's looking fantastic. He says the barbecue is burning. The barbecue. Hey, it's because I'm on fire. Tell me, did you buy some uh, very boring and not so good music here? Did you find some bullshit music from For your playlist? No, not in Macedonia. It's only the best in Macedonia. You know that. And it might not be true, but I'm not saying it on camera. Okay, maybe we, we will give you some names yeah, no, that you can put on your playlist. Well, look, it's up to you to decide what is good and what is bad. That's the beauty of music and art and creativity. And if you come to this festival, the Macedonia Buskers Festival, right across Macedonia over the next month, you'll see some fantastic things that we think are great and you'll probably think are great. You might not think they're great, but come see them anyway, because it's all about your experience, living your dream, finding your Is, tomorrow. Uh, people here uh, 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 strange not to give the money at the end of the show? Well, Are the Macedonians th cheap? The thing about street theater, about live, outdoor, busking performance, is that it is for everybody. Everybody gets to watch, and if you have the money, you pay. That's fair. But if you have no money, you still watch. And you don't enjoy. Leave. Don't and leave. No, stick around. Have some fun. When the artist okay, announced, well. he says, I'm doing this professionally at the end of the show. Please come. A lot of people stand up and... Well, people can be concerned, but we want you to know. If you have money, then sure, pay us, because it's our job. But if you have nothing, we can still let you watch the show, because that's the beauty of it. And just give a strong applause and a smile. Yeah, give us your love. Can you give us your beautiful smile? You give us the money, you give yeah, us your love, and, and I will give you this. <laughs>